The Hot Talker is a do-it-yourself telemetry module that sends measurement data in a special hot protocol to a telemetry receiver from Graupner. The development is based on the protocol publication of Graupner itself. The complete range of functions of the Hot Talker is explained in this video. The Hot Docker is a do-it-yourself telemetry data controller interfacing with Graupner Hot Receivers. The structure of this module is also very simple. It is a piggy board consisting of an interface board with power supply and an Atmega 32U4 Beetle. The microcontroller can work in 5 volt mode for USB programming and in 3.3 volt to communicate with Graupner receivers. The PCB board development and design for the Hot Talker was very simple, as it only had to meet two requirements. Firstly, a low noise 3.3 volt power supply and secondly, a connection system that is suitable for both the microcontroller and the components to be connected. The Hot Talker was developed based on the microcontroller at Mega 32U4 in the Arduino development environment in C++ and Assembler. Here, for an overview of all devices used in a common telemetry scenario. At first, the telemetry receiver sending data to the transmitter, and on the left side of the receiver the hot talker itself. Next the OLED display and 3 I to C sensors for temperature, altitude and current. The hot talker support four types of connection, firstly 1 I to C bus connection. Secondly, two connections for RPM and fuel sensors. Thirdly, two direct connections for digital input or output connections. Fourthly, three connections for analog sensors. The first pin blocks 0 and 1 is the I to C bus connector. The I2C bus was the real main reason for the development of the Hot Talker because the I2C world offers all necessary sensors and modules make hard sleep of RC model makers. Here a selection of suitable I2C devices which are available as standard modules. A special feature of the I2C sensors they usually provide the measured values directly as you need them without any additional software or hardware overhead. Another advantage is, you get them in high precision but still very cheap. Here a second scenario with an I to C infrared temperature sensor. The environment temperature is measured here with 27 degrees Celsius because it is summertime and it is fucking hot in hour. The refresh time of the display was set to about 2 seconds for the video recordings. Here I want to still point on two special I to see airspeed sensors. The first one is the well-known MS4525DO and the other one is the high-precision AMS5812. At pin blocks 2 and 3, pulse-driven sensors for speed and flow measurement are connected. The exact configuration of the sensors, such as the number of blades or the parameters for the flow calculation, are made on the transmitter in the menu. Here is a small overview of all impulse-driven sensors that have been used on the Hot Talker so far. Above are the flow sensors made of polyoxymethylene. Below different RPM sensors.
The short video shows the usage of RPM sensor. The sensor used in this video is an optical Graupner sensor, it's also the one I use most. These sensor is just the best you can get. Pin block 4 and 5 is for digital input and output devices. A specific output use has not been specified for this connector block yet. Optionally, only active buzzer was previously connected to these connections. One could connect to for example a MOSFET module as a switch or a 750 mA LED driver stage with PWM connector to control a power LED as navigation light. Now, last three pin blocks 6, 7 and 8. These three connections are for sensors need an analog digital converter. As an example should be mentioned NTC temperature sensors and voltage dividers. Finally, four analog sensors that have proven themselves in practice, as examples. The first is an NTC temperature sensor from EPCOS with thread that can be soldered to an eye, for example. Second, a current sensor from the Orange RX telemetry system, Thirdly, an easy to configure voltage divider from Frisky. The last one is a temperature sensor up to 200 degrees from Graupner, which is very easy to handle. What are the benefits of real-time telemetry? Receiving real-time information about the state and functioning of your airplane during flight enables the RC pilot to make informed decisions therefore contributing to overall safety and peace of mind. The Hot Talker provide various sorts of telemetry information such as temperature, current consumption, battery capacity, RPM, altitude and voltage. The Graupner radios provide these information via voice announcements or will present data on the radio screen. RC pilots can configure a range of switches on their radio that can activate voice telemetry announcements during flight informing the pilot for example how much capacity is left in their main battery. Thank you.